Hey everyone, happy Friday. I'm running a little bit late today. I'm trying to do a video every Friday around 2 or 2.30, but today I had a training that I was working on, so I'm a little bit late, but I wanted to share, I listened to a podcast this morning, and he was talking about sharing um, the reason behind you do what you do and the product that you sell and um, you know, connecting with your other, your prospects or your customers. And so I wanted to share a little bit with you today about the reason I chose doTERRA and the reason that I share it with others. Um, and I think the biggest reason is because I love the connection with other people. I love when I put a drop of oil in somebody's hand for the first time and watching their face just light up when they smell that smell because you know usually I share peppermint first because it's a, a strong smell and you can use it for so many different things um, and I have them drop it in their hand and inhale it and then rub it on the back of their neck and they feel that tingly feeling and I just love to see the awe in their face when they just see how wonderful it smells. Um, and I also love it because when I share it with people that maybe are going through something with their family, like maybe their husband has shoulder pain or they have sinus pressure or their child is having ear pain, um, I love to have them come back to me and say, hey, that really worked. I slept better last night or my child was able to sleep through the night without having pain. Um, and I love to share it with my own family. I love when my children come to me with some kind of problem, um, whether it be, we've worked on, you know, fingernails that um, had some kind of strange infection on them. Uh, we've worked on stomach pains. We've worked on um, skin rashes and all kinds of things. So I love being able to go to my pantry and have some type of solution for them. And it makes me feel empowered. Like I don't have to go to the doctor for every little thing. Um, you know, like my daughter's fingernail for one thing. She was insisting that we go to the doctor because she, we both knew that it looked infected and it was getting worse. And so, you know, she's like, I've got to go to the doctor. And I just thought, you know, I can go to the doctor. I can spend $50 and they're going to give me an antibiotic for it. Right. Or some kind of steroid cream. And I don't want her to take an antibiotic. We've been working on skin issues and things like that. And I know that antibiotics just mess with your gut. So if there's a way that I can handle it at home without going to the doctor and getting that antibiotic, then I'll do it. So I said, okay, look, we're just gonna try Melaleuca for a little while. And that's tea tree oil, if you didn't know that. And we're gonna try the Melaleuca and we're gonna do it for several days. We'll put it on there, we'll dilute it with some coconut oil, and we'll try it, you know, we'll put it on twice a day and see what happens. So we did that, and within a couple of days, it started to look better. And then I knew that I didn't have to go to the doctor. I didn't have to spend that $50. I didn't have to put her on an antibiotic that was gonna mess with her gut and cause possibly more skin issues. So I was so happy about that. And I can't tell you there's countless things like that that we've done, you know, um, maybe when they're having a stressful situation with school, I can put some serenity or lavender in their diffuser and they can sleep better. Um, you know, if they're having breathing troubles, I can use some breathe oil and that helps clear up their sinuses. So I love the feeling of being prepared and feeling empowered so I don't have to go to the doctor for every little thing. 
And, um, you know, when my mom was sick a while back with cancer, it was just the scariest feeling not knowing what to do to help her. I mean, we were searching the internet for anything we could find. And, you know, I'm not saying that essential oils can cure cancer because they can't, but they can support your system. And I like to use them because they can keep you from having lots of health problems. Um, and I just listened to a pod, or not a podcast, but a Facebook Live this week with Dr. Peter Osborne and John Templeton. And I put it on my, um, my personal page. So if you wanna go look at it there, he talks about how he survived cancer years ago. He um, was prescribed chemotherapy and it was making him sick. And the doctor said, you have 20% chance of living for three years. And uh, when he started the chemotherapy, he said, gosh, doctor, you know, I can't keep up with this. I'm getting sicker and I just feel like it's poisoning me. And the doctor said, well, you're not responding as well as I had hoped you would. So he's like, okay, that's it. I'm, I'm not doing any more of this. And he left and he had been researching some uh, natural cures to cancer. And so anyways, long story short, he healed his cancer. And when he was talking about all the survivors that he's talked to, that he's talked to over the years, he, they've all done several things over the years after their cancer was cured. And um, they keep a protocol. And on their protocol is vitamin C. So they take a lot of vitamin C. And another thing that they take every day is digestive enzymes. So last week in my video when I was talking about the cleanse, the doTERRA cleanse, um, one of the products I talked about was digestive enzymes. So uh, I am so happy that I am taking these and I'm not very good about taking them that often. So this is something that I'm just going to take more of. It, I mean, it helps your digestion and I don't know that it's gonna help keep me from getting cancer, but um, you know, I would love to support my digestive system so that, you know, that's one less area of my body that I have to work to support and take care of. And, um, you know, just one baby step at a time is how I approach my health. Um, you know, I started with diet, I drink water, I exercise, um, and this is another step that I can take. So, you know, if you have more questions about that or you want to know about it, let me know and I'll be glad to tell you more about it, help you order it if you want to. Um, and as the sun's shining on my face, I'm noticing I look oily up here. And that is so weird for me because my skin is so dry. And I started using the doTERRA Yarrow Palm Oil. And it's the blue oil that you put on your face with a dropper. And it is making my skin so much more moisturized. And I'm starting to actually look a little bit oilier up here, which I'll take it because I have never had oily skin in my whole life. And my husband has oily skin and he doesn't have any wrinkles on his face. So, um, you know, I'd rather have oily skin and no wrinkles. But uh, if the breakouts start, I would start to worry. But anyways, happy about that. So I thought I'd mention that. So I hope you have a great weekend and I will talk to you soon. Bye.